Greetings, travelers. Welcome back to Half-Life 2 with the, the disappearing army buggy. Right. Oh, well, I guess we'll have to go through that open hole in the wall that we saw. Another way down, like we saw before. Really? Okay, so this is pretty empty. Some health. Which is always appreciated. Okay, so that door's just not opening, period. Fuck you. There's another attic area. And there's a way back down. Oh no, can't even get back down this one. Of course, it still wouldn't be very good, because you imagine, like, someone's just downstairs and there's just hot coals just pouring down. But I guess if you start a fire there, it will go through all layers. So, I guess it makes sense. Unless you just set it up. Yeah, no. I don't like these things. I'm not sure how I'm supposed to get rid of these. somewhere so there's a boat over there I can check out oh my shot oh I'm a lot of shotgun shit <laughs> All right, let's check upstairs more crossbow that's always appreciated I think there is no crossbow bolts. I think you could only find the crossbows. Because the only time you'd ever find crossbow bolts is, well, in a crossbow. Of course, you could probably find some maybe in um, the, what's it called? The supply crates. So, yeah. I don't know. And you're out! It slowly crept its way back into the house. That's that's awesome. You know what? I haven't found anyone. Let's just keep this right now. Let's go check out that boat, if we can. Aww, there's a grave. Oh, there's gonna be ant lions here, aren't there? Okay, the fact that you can get on this tells me you can get in somehow. Are you kidding me? Oh! Hello! No, not really much. Wait, was there a way into this thing? No, doesn't look like it. 
But it did hide some, some, uh, some lovelies, so... No. Back to an actual weapon. Let's figure out how to get back up there. Ah, da 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 <laughs> No ant lions, please. Okay, so we appear to be done with this place. Let's continue on the road. I like this. Like, you can just find, ha like, houses along the road. All my bad driving, I'm just me. Just gonna say. Are you kidding me? It took a whole clip, but I got him. First things first, because, like always, I want to explore. Bye bye bye. <laughs> I can't understand what they're saying half the time, but I don't know. Energy's always good. Energy's almost as good as health. Sometimes even better. Because with energy, you take less damage. Which is good. Okay, so there's nothing here. I think I'll just break right through this, so it's like, I could've just skipped right past all of this. But, eh, whatever. Hell, there's even a ramp. That worked. I'm a good driver, I swear. I swear. Maybe? Something around? Come on. 
like where my Let's just try something. Here's another guy. Where is he at? Oh, I got shot from over here too. Is there another guy over here? Maybe? I don't know. Okay, there's another guy in there somewhere. Over here somewhere. Where are you? Probably over here somewhere. Really? Did I just really get hurt from that? Oh, he's probably in here. My dumbass didn't decide to actually look in here. Okay, I need to find batteries. That's what it's telling me. Where would another battery be? Is there gonna be one over here somewhere? My question is, what happens if I just throw the battery, like... You know, somewhere really far? Like, let's say it was in this car and I did that. Just saying. Would it be like, mission critical equipment has been destroyed? I'm not gonna try, but it makes me wonder. gate's probably open. Yep. Alright, let's get in the car. Chatter. They're looking for your car. Oh, really? Get well, your car shit. in the garage. 
I was about to say, should I just leave it out? You over there. Okay, Doc. You'll have to go on foot from here. There's a secret path along the cliffside, but no one's going anywhere until we fight off this attack. Having you here to fight alongside us is going to make a big difference for morale. Okay, sure. I'm fine with that. Here come the dropships. Dropships, eh? Well, good thing I just happen to have a... Oh, you said dropships. Plural. Shit. <laughs> you guys don't happen to have an unlimited supply of rockets laying around, do you? Nope, I did nothing. Got ammo. They just were nice enough to give it to me. Incoming dropship! Shotgun ammo. Take some ammo. Thanks. You wouldn't happen to have any like good ammo? I'm full on shotgun. Shotgun, plenty of health. I think everything worked out pretty well. This way, Dr. Freeman. We'll take the cliff path before another gunship finds us. I love how they actually, like, did their pathfinding to come find me. They weren't expecting me to look for the right person and figure out what to go. The right guy came to me. I can understand why they're not bringing out Half-Life 3. Half 
Half-Life 1 and Half-Life 2. Right along there. And watch your step. Like, Half-Life 1 and Half-Life 2 broke so much ground that there's no way they could actually do a Half-Life 3 without, like, you know... What the hell is shooting at me? They took my car! Freeman, we'll take the cliff path before another gunship finds us. Yeah, they already find you. I've seen the future. Come on, now open it up. Oh, there's still another. <laughs> right along there, and watch your step. Yeah. I'm sure I'm not going to be an idiot and completely just fall off the fucking cliffside. Like a fucking idiot. I'm not that dumb. in that little alcove. But yeah. Yay, I'm done with the car. I'm so happy. I'm not good at driving in video games. <laughs> so it's like... Less, like, Don't get me wrong. I'm okay with driving if it's like part of the game. But I don't know. You there! Stop where you are! Stay on the rocks! Don't step on the sand, it makes the antlions crazy. Laszlo, don't move. No. Help! Dear God, poor Laszlo, the finest mind of his generation. They come to such an end. We were heading for the Vortigaunt camp, hoping to pick up some bug baits of these damn things and leave us alone. Bug bait? But without Laszlo, what's the point? I know you tried to help. I'll stay with him a while. There's something I have to do. Go ahead. I hope you have better luck than we had. Sure. I think I remember, remember this. To stay off the sand. The ant lions are edgy right now. Sure. I think I remember this. There's an achievement for getting through this whole level without, like, setting off any ant lions. Not gonna actually give a shit. Just saying. Because, for the most part, yeah. Ooh. So far, I'm doing pretty good, though. I remember there was a sneaky way, because there's a part where you have to, like, yeah. I mean, I might actually go for it. I don't think I've ever done it, so... Might as well try. But... I think it's really a pain in the ass. I don't know. Let's see how I go. If I fuck up, I fuck up. 
And I didn't fuck up. So far, so good. I know where I have to get through that. At least I think. <laughs> I'm not 100% sure. Cannot. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Do that. No way. Fuck. Good. So yeah, I fucked that up. <laughs> I wasn't really trying anyway. I like how like that doesn't set them off. Like I gotta get this way, so oh. Oh. good thing these things are weak. But I'm running low on ammo, and this is the part right here. This is the one where you're supposed to have the two boxes, or whatever, or three boxes, and you have to like, eh, 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 eh. I'm just gonna run. <laughs> Fuck! Yeah. <laughs> Freeman will do wise to hear their expression of the Myrmidon's aromatic pteropods. The process is not entirely hygienic, therefore, stand aside. Are, are you gonna pull its testicles off? The Freeman will have need of these pteropods on the paths ahead. Gather them now. Yay! 
How many do I have? Unlimited. Three men must follow. Sure. What if happens if I throw one on you? Nothing? Well, you guys. Next time you guys go out, you guys are going to be, uh, very enticing. You know, seeing like this, them talking their own language, it's like one of those things that you go into like a 7-Eleven and it's like the owners are talking in like their own language. Do you, is just ahead. Right near. One man alone wouldn't stand much chance going in there. But a man with a pack of ant lions, well, that's a different story. Yeah. I, I have a pack of ant lions. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I know exactly what the scrap pods do. The free man honors us by his presence. Mm. Follow free man. Sure. Sure. won't even come after me. Freeman has done well. The Freeman okay. can also coax his appliance to attack specific powers. Observe the training method and mark it well with another therapy. Freeman again excels at all tasks. I th threw a ball. And I like how he didn't say, like, right click to bring him towards. It's like this game's become an RTS. Which, funny enough, that was one of the things for Half Life 3. Apply pressure to your therapy to signal the outlines in your command to follow you. Yeah. Free man shows his excellence in all things. Yeah, I've done it like ten times. And now this one must have been the free man farewell. No prospect lies just beyond. <laughs> Remember well what you have learned here. The Eli Vance has greatest confidence in you. Yeah, I'm sure he does. Alright, my little baby. Call me. You are one with me. A little longer than I was expecting, but I think this was a good episode so far. We got ourselves some pets. I, I know I killed a lot of your kind, but you like me, right? You're just like the Vorden. You're the Vorden. Vorden not. Whatever the fuck those things are called. Vortigaunts. Vortigaunts. You're just like the Vortigaunts. I kill all of your species, but now that I have something you want. You're my best friend. Now kill each other. Okay, whatever. Alright, I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.